The Heimlich maneuver can sometimes remove a foreign body from the airway and save a person's life. It's critical to rapidly recognize foreign body airway obstruction and respond immediately. Signs of severe airway obstruction include cyanosis and inability to speak, cough, or breathe. People often also clutch their throat, which is considered the universal distress signal. Shortly thereafter, people lose consciousness. If the person can speak, cough, and breathe, do not do a Heimlich maneuver because they don't have severe airway obstruction. Forceful coughing may relieve a mild or moderate obstruction. Ask, are you choking? To differentiate mild from severe airway obstruction. If the choking person can't reply or nods yes, do a Heimlich maneuver. Stand directly behind the choking person and encircle their midsection with your arms. Clench one fist and place it midway between the umbilicus and xiphoid. Grab the fist with your other hand and pull sharply backward and upward with both arms. Repeat as needed up to six or ten times. Apply significant force. Use more than a firm hug but not your maximum strength to avoid injuring the ribs or internal organs. Given the rapidly fatal nature of the situation, use your best judgment as to the appropriate force. If the choking person is obese or in late pregnancy, use chest thrusts instead of abdominal thrusts. In children less than 20 kilograms, typically less than five years, apply only very moderate pressure. Kneel at the child's feet rather than over their torso or standing. In infants under one year, don't do the Heimlich maneuver. Continue efforts without interruption until the airway obstruction is removed or advanced airway intervention is available. After successful removal, have the person brought to an emergency department if they have residual symptoms or if they were unconscious. If they feel fine and are breathing normally, an evaluation is optional.